hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's Ford here again if you're stopping by for the first time please kindly consider hitting on the subscribe button and subscribe to my channel but if you're not thank you so much for always always sticking around i really do appreciate guys it's been a long time and i promise to be uploading videos every week on this channel but then life happens work everyone gets busy the good thing is i'm back here so guys today i'm gonna to be doing something a little different not really different two months ago i made a video about different um, streams of income that will make you level up in your 20s and become a millionaire in that video i talked about going you know deeper into this it thing i mean there are so many it skills that are out there that anybody can pick up and learn and start doing and i asked you guys if i should dive more into it talk and do more it related videos and some of you were like yeah someone also asked me to make a video about courses you can take and um, website or platform where you can take courses and you know become it savvy and then platforms where you can start looking for it jobs that are remote and today i have decided to do that video it took me a while because i already explained earlier but i'm here now and i'm going to be teaching you guys how to level up your it career and work smart from home in your 20s in 2022 so without further ado let us hop straight into this video right away just before we continue have you heard about the album africa welcomes the world by mizonic if not then what are you waiting for it is on different streaming platforms like apple music youtube music spotify etc i will leave the links down below on the description box make sure you check it out and share with your friends and family so yeah basically this video is going to be more focused on learning and platform where you would learn and then we're going to dive into platform where when you feel confident enough about yourself and you want to go into workforce platform where you can search for jobs so first of all i do not want this video to be more than eight minutes or ten minutes so let me dive straight into it so i've been in the it field for over four years now and i can tell you that if you want to tilt into it or if you want to be tech savvy it has to do with consistency intentionality and everyday learning what i mean is that you have to keep learning you have to keep learning let's say you know about a tool that tool would not be the same it will keep on upgrading every day you will hear version this is out version that is out so if you are ready to begin your it journey one thing you must have in mind is that you are going to be an everyday learner you would always learn you will always have to read up things you always have to like stay on top of your game and one more thing google is your best friend so now talking about platforms where you can start learning and courses you can easily learn platforms like coursera skill up i think linkedin udacity udemy these five places are places i have tried learning some courses to enhance my career and i must tell you that these platforms are extremely remarkable when it comes to learning now talking about coursera some people feel like oh you have to pay you have to pay i can afford that bro that's a lie so now let me give you a hack if you want to do a course in coursera regardless the course it is you can actually get it for free now all you have to do is to go to their website and click or search a particular course you are interested in learning under that course make sure you look very well don't click on the course and, and they will tell you register now you have to pay and all that no look below the course you're gonna see somewhere they wrote request for financial aid now let me tell you something as far as you're in Africa and as, and as far as you are interested in learning when you click on financial aid you have a few forms to fill where you write a letter where you why you really need this course or something like that regardless of what you put on that letter as far as you're in africa you are 90 percent um eligible like there is 90 percent possibility that you are going to be eligible because i have introduced friends and i've sent them formats on how to write letters and how to apply for financial aid on Coursera and the good thing is they have never denied anyone of any course. I have viewed so many financial aid courses and trust me 
they were all granted all you has all you have to do is to click on that course you want click on um get financial aid for this course write to them tell them the reason why you need this and in two weeks boom your course will be released in udemy i think you can actually pay but udemy have free courses sometimes they just let you register for courses for free for 24 hours so you just have to keep checking their website linkedin learning is there audacity is there you can also like apply and then when you scale through they will give you the course there is scale up there for skill up once you register you're automatically allowed to you know take three free courses and when you keep inviting people they keep giving you avenues to take more courses for free so here money is not a problem so what are you waiting for what are those courses you want to do i actually advise people who are trying to move from other field to it field to you know start from small you can go for it support you can do us ui i'm not saying us ui is small but if you're interested in coding if you're interested in coding like i said like I said before, IT is not about coding. I mean, it's not about it. There are so many things you can do in IT. So if you're interested in coding, you can just start from one programming language, familiarize yourself, and you can expand. I mean, there are a whole bunch of things you can do. So now, what you have to do for yourself is to decide and find a path in which you want to take to become an IT savvy person or to become an or to become an IT person. When you find a path or something you have flair for, or something you feel like you can do, something you feel like you will enjoy doing, then go ahead and go to any of this platform, take courses and come back and, take me, and thank me later. Now, we are gonna be proceeding to platforms where you can get jobs easily after you are prepared for a particular job role in the IT field. Now, there are some freelancer sites and all which I had mentioned before in my video. If you haven't seen this video, please, I'll leave it down on the description box. Make sure you click on that video. It is informative just as this one is right here. Click on that video and, you know, make sure you watch the end. It will give you some insight about the freelancing website. So you can also sign up to this freelancing website that I, have, that I have mentioned in the other video. If you want to know, then click on the link below and go watch that video. But now I'm going to be talking more about platforms that are more precise for remote jobs because if you're in Nigeria and you know what's happening right now, everybody wants to earn in dollars and you know, you have to do that job remotely right here in Nigeria to earn your dollars, right? So the first one is flex you can go there register i mean there are a whole bunch of them all you have to do is to go to their website sign up and start looking for the job you want to i can assure you that if you keep applying for jobs especially on linkedin as well i can assure you that if you keep applying for jobs you would definitely get one of them i also used to tell people that they should sign up on linkedin because linkedin is somewhere you can be recommended you can just be on your own and someone contacts you and boom you're already interviewed and you've gotten a job so make sure you sign up on linkedin and you know feel your experiences the course you've done what you are looking for try to you know connect with people that are on the same field as you and hopefully you'd get some so there are so many of these websites i'm just going to mention a few of them there is just remote there is we work Remotely, there is flex job, there is virtual vocation, there is a whole lot of them. I'm going to leave the link down below for you to see so many websites where you can apply for remote work and boom, you're working remotely and earning just from the comfort of your home. After you might have studied and, and you are comfortable to start working. I mean, this job ranges from different kind of IT job, from IT support to UI US, from software engineering to devops to product management project management as well there are a whole lot of them so i'm going to leave the links below just in case you are ready and you want to start learning you also want to start looking for jobs just would help a lot but one thing i tell people is 
make sure you apply for at least five jobs a day and do not ever get tired of receiving rejection mails because you are going to get tons of it but that doesn't matter right you're not going to be discouraged so i mean if you get them just dust off your cv keep applying make sure you like apply maybe for at least five or ten jobs a day let me give you a trick of how to easily apply if you're using linkedin so what you all you're going to do is to set a job alert go to your linkedin search for a particular job and select the filter click remote if you want a remote job click the period of time you want them to show you a particular job maybe the last 24 hours last three days last seven days click the country you want if it's worldwide if it's remote click everything and then click on the button that shows activate job alert once this job alert is activated every day when you wake up linkedin is going to send you loads of jobs available for the time you have selected so all you have to do is to keep clicking on them and applying and there's something they call easy apply on linkedin so if you click on easy apply all you have to do is to just click 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 and you've applied other than you filling a whole bunch of form so basically i think that's all for today let me know if you guys want us to officially start doing tech talks if you guys want that then there are a whole lot of things i'm going to be sharing in that tech talk playlist i'm going to talk about i'm going to be talking about my transitioning from networking to development operations which is devils i'm going to be bringing people that are self-taught that have taught themselves or studied on their own and became software engineers became different kind of became us ui designers became network engineers the devops engineer and a whole bunch of things so let me know if you guys are interested in this kind of video and we are going to be hopping on it anyways like i said when i said this video i don't want this video to be so long so i have to drop it here let me know if this video interested you if you are enlightened and more educated let me also know if you want this kind of video so i will make more of it i'm not saying i will stop vlogging but i'm just saying that if you want this video i'm just gonna click i'm just gonna create a playlist and make something that is educative and enlightening like this have you heard about the album africa welcomes the world by mizonic if not then what are you waiting for it is on different streaming platforms like apple music youtube music spotify etc i will leave the links down below on the description box make sure you check it out and share with your friends and family anyways i guess this makes us to the end of this video if you love this video then do not forget to like share subscribe to my channel and i'll catch you guys in my next one and until then bye